Just 25 kilometers northwest of the capital, Accra, a defunct communications dish converted into a radio telescope. We've changed the motors that used to drive the antenna. We've changed the receivers that are used to receive data from the antenna. We've renovated the antenna, we've painted the antenna because some parts were going bad through corrosion. So we've done all those things. We've changed some few parts that were rusted. Located 70 meters above sea level, it can detect radio signals and collect radio waves from the space. It will benefit Ghana and beyond. Because of this antenna, we'll have some good road networks around here. And because we deal with um, internet facilities, so the internet uh, situation in this community will improve as well. There are a lot of spin-offs. We have a, a mechanical engineers, electrical engineers, all being trained, and also training software engineers to, to back up the, uh, this SKA project. Is the continent's first function in radio telescope outside South Africa? South Africa and the um, partner countries in Africa, there's eight of them at this point in time, are key players in all of those consortia, global science and global engineering efforts. And um, that positions us, you know, for the global knowledge economies and um, to make sure that Africa can also um, be taken along in those journeys. It's hoped this program will help unravel the mysteries of the universe and find answers to what perplexed astronomers for hundreds of years. Marie Gita Mutabe, SABC News, Accra, Ghana.